forgetting Claire's not used to this. I'm gonna scare her off if I'm not careful. Crispin's my ticket into the auction and my only shot at getting close to Iraq. He needs to disappear. This, this kind of looks more like Toronto than it does the Magnificent Mile. There's a certain level of grime that just isn't in this part of the city like there is in the real world Chicago. This looks too that clean. It looks exposed. Canadian. Better go in quietly. But, you know, that, that's cool. What the hell? That's where the real entertainment value comes in, everybody. Mr. Quinn wanted your first time in Chicago to be memorable, sir. Mm -hmm. Sure does purr, doesn't it? Exotic and fast. <laughs> Mr. Quinn didn't know which color you'd like, so um, you can take whichever. That one, right? Get her ready for when I return. He must have a schedule or something on his phone. Can't let him get away. They do, you know, in the real life in Mad Mile, they, well, Magnificent Mile. It's a insane asylum up there, so yeah, Mad Mile is a good name for it. But anyway, up there they do have a lot of, um, I mean, not a lot, I know there's like three of them that I know of, dealerships that have exotic cars in them, kind of like that one. Maybe not so much like that, but first time I ever went to Chicago, I walked by one of them. They had a Bugatti Veyron in there, a, a friggin' Bugatti, million dollar car. Felt like I was at the zoo or something, and I just saw a Siberian tiger. It was, you know, like there's no way in hell I would have been able to afford one of those in my lifetime. Hell, I don't think I'd be able to even rent a Bugatti. And there I was. I was standing like basically right next to it. Looks like Crispin was on his way to pick up something called the Poppy Special. It's at a club called Infinite 92. Infinite 92. No official listings. I see mention of it in some thread here. Oh, looks like it's a gentleman's fetish club. Underground, of course. So the Poppy Special is a woman. That fits the profile Quinn had on Crispin. I doubt Poppy would have survived the meeting. What kind of auction is this? I think we both know the answer to that. I'm going to the club now. Crispin's invite is there. Poppy special. I don't know if that's like a reference to opium or if that's a... Sometimes, sometimes it's best that I don't speak. All right. Here I am all monstering up for the monster ball. Okay, just keep your hands. Stay as little as possible. Crispin's as fucked up as they say. I'm going to draw attention. Just find the auction invite and get out. The poppy special. Very good, Mr. Crispin. A signature dish prepared especially for you. 
Any weapons? Mr. Crispin, right this way, please. What happened to the guards assigned to you? Okay, now for everybody watching right now, I should I should probably warn you. You might see a nipple in the following cutscene. Not that nipples are bad, but you know, you just watch out. Just be careful. I don't want to offend people. Good lord. Of course, this isn't the Obama administration anymore, so it shouldn't be a big deal, but you never know. Anybody who eats meat only deserves to be hacked. You know, not that meat is murder. I'm not one of those psychos. You know, meat only. That if you, if you eat meat only, you're probably a psychopath. This guy's on medication for schizophrenia, but he's in a sex club, so, you know, man, you get justice where you can find it. Mr. Quinn wanted to ensure you're comfortable. On his behalf, we offer you a special gift. Please, enjoy as much as you like. You're my special gift, eh? What's your name? Poppy? I know about you. What you do to girls. No, it's not. It's okay. I'm done. Mr. Crispin, is everything to your liking? You interrupt me again and you're next. I'm not gonna hurt you. Just come with me. They'll find me. They said you were a monster. You're not Crispin, are you? My name is Pierce. He's planning a cruise. I don't know if I should. Yeah, like I said, no, he's in a sex club. He's a perv. Besides, I'm probably doing him a favor. I mean, you don't want to go on a cruise. My gun. We hope you'll come back again. Yes, lady, give me back my crappy Beretta, not the awesome Sig Sour. I need a favor. I gotta get Poppy out of this place. Call Infinite 92, pretend you're Crispin's assistant. Tell him I insist that Poppy be delivered to me at the auction. Yes, okay. She'll be there. I'll make sure of it. Maybe Crispin has to die. At least we can save this girl. That's something, right? I'm not sure we can add things up so cleanly, but we're gonna get her out. Once again, I don't advocate drunk driving. Drunk gaming, absolutely. Drunk driving, no. 
Absolutely not. By the way, I'm sober right now. now. Sit down. Throw that out there. I can take you. <laughs> Just like old friends. <laughs> Come on, drink up. Good man. Oh uh, yeah, these definitely get harder. Oh shit. Which is not the first time I've said that in a bar. This gun is, um, well, it's unique. You take it to an freak anybody out. That's it. That's what most people see. Actually, I should drive this all the way down to South Chicago and then take it to an alley. That's how they do it in real life, Chicago. But I don't want to drive all that way f that far to get down. I actually like this better than Division's, you know, cover system. Just press A, you get to it. You want to turn the corners, press A, you know. I don't know. You should have left town, Pat. Yo! Stay ah! <laughs> oh, wait a minute, did I, oh jeez. Well, like I said, this gun's pretty ridiculous, but, but check this out. Look, it's a, it's a Mossberg 500, and it fires in bursts. Could have, they could have made it like a special Benelli that does it, but yeah, they had to make it a Mossberg. I'm not a gun nut. I just, it's just that you know that kind of stuff is just, it just kind of irks me a little bit. But whatever. Quinn's auction. Rack's somewhere inside. Security's gonna be tight, and it won't be long before someone reports my message. Just find a rags, make a clean getaway. <laughs> Sounds easy enough. Something tells me it's not gonna go down that way. <laughs> 